Hello and welcome to another stream here on Behance and on YouTube. My name is Anna Davis Court. I'm a children's book illustrator here to paint and draw with you today. And this is my best friend Anthony Sims who likes to read the Hello. chat and he has cool clear glasses. So everybody compliment those glasses. Whoa, thanks. Yeah. Yours are even more clear. You can't even see. Oh, whoa. <laughs> They're lighter than air. <laughs> <laughs> I like to laugh like a pompous. It's devious how clear your <laughs> glasses are. <laughs> yes, indeed. Oh, quite devious. You don't even know. I feel like I have to. Shake green in the chat. And anonymous. And T Ross. And Rin. Ah, friends. But who was first? Who gets the gold star today? It was anonymous. <gasps> anonymous panda. Gold star. But D Ross was right there. And considering how late D is usually. <laughs> Wow! That's pretty much gold star material. D, you're always early in my heart. And thank you for being here. Whoop, whoop, whoop. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so today I wanted to... Uh, well, first of all, I just want to ask, how is everybody doing? It's Wednesday here. This is the week of Lightbox. If you haven't heard yet, we have a big convention going on in the art community. Uh, it is $2 to have access to everything basically that they offer and then you could buy extra goodies if you want to um, but I would highly recommend being a part of that because it is awesome Lightbox Expo so uh, we will be streaming for that here on Behance you do not have to be signed up for Lightbox to see it but it will be a part of their what do you call it schedule schedule <laughs> fancy um, and so yeah we're gonna be here on Saturday and also we have a podcast dropping this Friday it's a very exciting week um, but how is everybody else doing? What are your plans for the rest of the week? Are you getting through it all right? Do you need a little extra energy? Should we just energize you? What? That was... What is that? Uh, it was, I mean, I don't want to say. It was injecting you with like some kind of serum. <laughs> I'm baning you right now. <laughs> okay, so get the mask on. Are you ready for the juice? <laughs> You're the bane of my existence, but in a good way. <laughs> The strongest and most fiercest one. <laughs> Nobody get about me before I put on the mask. <laughs> yes, yes. I forgot your... how you were Bane. <laughs> do, do your best Bane. Um, I can't. I only saw that movie like once, but you I can... could try to do what you just did. Yeah. Nobody cared about me except for when I put on the mask. I love how you butchered that quote. It was great. Okay, now say, oh. <laughs> um, no, I'm going to give you a normal line and you're going to say it like that. Uh, they're after me lucky charms. They're after me lucky charms. <laughs> Does he do that? You're getting vatery. <laughs> uh, oh, golly. You got very violent when you opened up the plan. I know. Could you imagine if Darth Vader's mask just opened like that? It was like Predator Jaws. Yes. <laughs> I want to see that mashup. Yeah, up. I could totally see that. Like, Anakin, you've changed. <laughs> <Whoa>. <laughs> Anyways, out of all the movies that we just referenced, which one's your favorite? <laughs> <laughs> I really like the original Predator. I'm excited for the remake. Oh, we're being simulcasted. Oh, why hello, Adobe Live. That means that... Cody give it a Bears... second. Give it a second. Oh, I'm giving it a second. I'm giving it a second. Okay, okay. It means that Cody Bear's new show just ended, which is the Draw This In Your Style show. And I love it. I love that the whole concept, Cody bringing on guests, seeing all the different artists work, and then drawing each other's stuff is just the coolest thing. So tune into that. It's going to be back, I believe. <laughs> I think it's going to be tomorrow again. Same time, same place. But hey, welcome cool. to Adobe Live. I'm Anna Davis Court. I'm a children's book illustrator. This is my friend Anthony. He co hosts with hello, me and hello. reads this, the chat. There are links for all of our stuff down in the description, as well as our amazing mods who are Joe and Kendall. Uh, anyways, we are going to hop into drawing. We just got here, so good time to be simulcast. So today we're going to be doing rainbow. No, uh, <laughs> right now what we're going to be doing is washi tape designs. That's what I chose for today. Oh, Anthony I should have guessed. I know you requested it. It's like know? it's a rainbow, just stripes of color. You know, that's but all you I were just to do talking about washi tape. Rainbow, and I'm done. <laughs> uh, yeah, I wanted to do some washi tape designs, but I also wanted to kind of push it in terms of. Um, color and value and stuff like that because I feel like I, I've done some offhand washi tape designs before where I was just like having fun and jiving and I think my favorite designs came out of colors that I wasn't expecting uh, especially as the background so 
I wanted to start with a pseudo rainbow. I'm probably gonna add a few extra colors in here, like between the yellow and the green, maybe I'll have, or maybe, mm, I love the green to blue transition, just like you, Anthony, you know, we're yeah, green to blueies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So uh, I think that either a, a, like a really yellowy green or a minty blue. What do you think, which one? Minty blue. Minty blue. Okay, we're going straight to green then with this guy. And of course we can zhuzh all these colors. I'm just throwing them in here to start the creative juices going because sometimes you need something to start. You ever feel that with your stuff where it's just like the blank canvas is the worst part of it? Mm-hmm. Got to start somewhere, darling. I'm going to go lighter with this one. Uh, values is also... So I was just talking about this in Cody's stream, actually. Is, uh, is Cody asked what... Uh, Oh, sorry, I just got distracted. Apparently we get a unique URL for, oh yeah, okay. So when Adobe Live simulcasts us, it gives us a link to Adobe Live and then a unique URL for our stream. I just noticed that. Anyways, random. Um, so what I was saying was, uh, Cody was asking what thing is like something you're basically constantly working on with your artwork, whether you enjoy doing that or not. Sometimes it's a struggle, sometimes it's less of a struggle. Um, and it was because her guest Stevie brought up that she's actually enjoying perspective lately, which is kind of a rare thing to hear from an artist. <laughs> enjoying perspective? What? So uh, that's uh, one thing that I thought of immediately was values, because I always feel like I'm kind of weak on values. Um, but I think that's partially because I jump into color so fast. I just want to get to the color. And so when you're doing color, you, you know, kind of are considering value at the same time, which can lend itself to being weaker. So just as an example, uh, I'm going to fill a layer with black and I set it to color. So we're going to turn this black and white basically. So you can see there are different values of these colors, even though we're just throwing color in. It inherently has a choice being made. <laughs> so just keep that in mind if you're ever doing anything, anything ever. Getting groceries, keep this in mind. Think about it day and night. Well, you do think a lot about value while you are grocery shopping. Good job. <laughs> the truest form of laughter. <laughs> Indeed. All I'm thinking of right now is what colors do I like? <laughs> so that's how I'm going through this. I'm just picking like, what's a red that I like? What's an orange that I like? Okay. Wait, so, sorry, did I miss what you said about checking the value on it? Do you Check want them value. consistent or do you want red yeah. darker and then it goes to lighter? Or what were you checking the value for? I was just describing or showing uh, an example of how when you're choosing color, you're inherently choosing value as well. Um, oh. But I don't care for this. This is like, this is blue sky design. So it really doesn't necessarily matter if it's dark or lighter, as long as the values of the individual design works. So it's not like I'm like, I have to have a dark blue design or whatever. Um, we could do a challenge like that, but right now I'm just kind of, just messing just yeah. dib dabbing around uh if we we're to inject one extra color into this rainbow where would you want to put it at the bottom i mean between what colors <laughs> like we did the blue green so oh. if we're doing like a we really want a blue purple like a lilac or periwinkle or do we want to do like a red purple like a magenta e goodness uh, do we want to put that limey green in that like really oh there was a problem loading this video Pre please reload the page it says on Behance do you know if we're still here I think we're still here okay. yeah you're then still I'll just ignore it <laughs> still going all right Chad if you see us they do let us I'm watching know. the Behance video so don't. <laughs> we see you <laughs> oh and Alessandra's asking what we're doing today we're designing washi tape. If you don't know what washi tape is, Google it. No, uh, it's a tape that you can print a design on, basically. Um, but anyways, I've been rambling on a, a lot, so let me know if the chat's saying other things. Periwinkle. Jake Green suggests periwinkle. Boom. I'm going for it. Perfect. Also, there was a lot of love for Jake Green in the chat, saying how we missed him the other As day. As usual. Oh, there's a lot of Jake Green love all over the place. Yeah. All over the place. <laughs> 
Anonymous asks, Anna, one day can you do a drawing, but it's on grayscale, and then make it normal colors and see how it looks? Wait, so you start with black and white, and then and then you make it quote-unquote normal colors? What does that mean? Yeah. Colorize a black and white illustration. Okay, if that's what you're asking for, I can try. I, Maybe you I paint that... in only values, only grays and... Absolutely, I would love to do just value paintings. I mean, um, it, that's the thing is, it, it, it depends on the intention. Are you intending to color it, or are you intending for it to just stay values? Because It sounds like it would be intentionally wanting to color it at the end. Gotcha, okay. I can try. I still don't think I have like a solid way of doing that necessarily. Um, in terms of like in Photoshop bringing something to color, I know that selective color is a huge help with that, but uh, I think my tendency would be just do a really rough value and then paint completely new layer over it, which I guess does that's still require you know fulfilling the requirements. So <laughs> I could do yeah. that. I could do it if you want to. I could leave my friends behind. I never would do that. Rin says, posted a photo of my woodland washi in the show and tell section oh on Discord. Gosh, we gotta look at it. Okay. And Tara says, okay. Jake, you were missed on Monday and mentioned quite a bit during the stream. LOL. <laughs> How is it already Wednesday? I know it I has know. been going by quick. Anna and I did the stream on Monday, recorded the podcast yesterday, and now doing this all at the same time, really. So it's just been like, go, go, go. It's been a lot. Like, well, first of all, by the way, we've got uh, what a an Udi looks like. <laughs> uh, yeah, this is what it looks like, and it's got pandas! Aww, oh, cozy. I love the cuffs, too. It's just like this whole... It's a fashion statement. I love yeah, it. they look like those stereotypical chef hats, but on your wrist. <laughs> <laughs> I've always wanted that chef hat, like that cartoonish chef hat on my wrist. Yeah, perfect. <laughs> I could very much see Corinne wearing this. Her favorite thing in the world is pandas, so this is just upper alley. But look Anonymous at Anonymous Panda says that's the one I have. <gasps> oh no way! I love Makes it. Makes sense. Fashion. Uh, and this woodland uh, collection of washi tapes is very impressive. They're so pretty. Oh yeah, that little mm. raccoon. Taylor Owls. Raccoons. One of Rin's squirrels. favorites. Of course. And then we've got What's this floral thing at the top? Is that some sort of It looks like flowers? Is it is it a certain type of flower? I can't really make out what it is. I guess um, I could go to Discord and look at the non compressed. Yeah, version. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if I could decipher what kind of flower, but they're really pretty. I also really flower. love this just orange with the white flower or uh, leaves on it. That's very fall and pleasing to my eye. Uh the most recent one I just got, I'm going to go to the big cam so you can maybe see a little bit of this. I know it's really small, sorry, is <laughs> the focus is back here. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's this uh, clover washi tape by Leanne. How do we say the last name? It's P-F-L-U-G. Flug? Leanne Flug. She's uh, Loon Flug. As her handle. She's amazing. Anyways, I love her stuff. And uh, it came with so many things that are... It, it's all botanical. You guys will love it. I'll put her in the creative shout section after the stream. Sound good? Sound good? Thank you so much, Alessandra. For, or wait, Rin! This is Rin. Sorry. I, whew, that was a big mind meld. You even said Rin loves uh, 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 owls. So thank you, Rin. Of course you would have this. Duh. I love it. To love it. To love it. Also, I see a bunch of, uh, it looks like colored pencils in the background. I know what you are. Are any of these inspiring you to draw on these washies? Uh, yeah. I, I don't know anybody who could look at washi tape and not be inspired. Yes, Rin knows. Loon Plug. <laughs> Thank you, Anthony, for putting a link in the chat. By the way, if you're oh. watching on YouTube, uh, there we're all chatting in the Behance chat, so come on over here. It's behance.net. You can find my page and like, well, you can find a link to it in the description. I put it there for you. <laughs> One day they'll be watching on YouTube. <laughs> you know, it happens. Yeah, see, the people we've got we have people in there. Yeah, but they're right. also on Behance. <laughs> is the thing. <laughs> yeah, they're double chatting. They can't get enough yeah. of chat. They're just like, ooh, let's. These have a are the people that care the here. most. <laughs> 
head over to YouTube and press that little thumbs up button I think... while you're there. <laughs> no. There's no pressure to do so. It's more for accessibility. Push it. Can. Push it oh, or the video will stop. <laughs> push it. Jay Green just pushed it. Nice uh, work. Alessandra pushed it. Oh my wow. gosh, wait, how do you know? It's getting this? thummy. They said did. it in chat. Well, I did. <laughs> <laughs> Why? I also see oh, the thumbs yes. going up on YouTube, but for some reason I still can't see thumbs it on Behance. Going so. up. <laughs> I want the world to know. Oh. To know. Oh. Okay, now this is the time when I need your guys' help. Shout out things that I should put on this washi tape. R random word. Go, Anthony. Go. Ladybug. Ladybug. Okay. <laughs> I just cool. thought of something red. <laughs> no, I love it. That's great. And we can combine it with Chick other Green things. Green says banana. Well, that's what Anonymous says. Rin says crows. <laughs> crows and bananas and ladybugs. Crows you should write these down in the margins. Bananas. Banana, crows. Oh, no. I'm clips. I'm clips. Leaf clover. <laughs> I've imprisoned myself. They're coming. Okay. They keep coming. Ban Banana. Clover. Crows. Which I, okay, yeah. I already, Clovers. I, yeah. I can't do it better L than Leanne. Leaf um, clover, specifically. Um, and crows, like the bird. Crows or corvids. Crows. And Ibrahim suggests durian. durian. Thanks, Ibrahim, for that really easy to draw fruit. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's great and spiky. It's one of my favorite <laughs> things to get in Breath of the Wild. <laughs> and then you make it for uh is that endurance? I'm playing. Is it? I thought it was attack. Oh, if we could use that if if video game music is like copyright free so for some reason. Some people play Animal Crossing music in the background of their streams and I'm like, is that copyright free? I don't know. And I've Googled it a few I times and it's always so. like gray. And so, well, if knowing we could... Nintendo, no, <laughs> they always cease and desist everything. Well, on Twitch, they do it all the time. Like, there's nonstop Animal Crossing music, and I love it, and I want to do that. Do you want a couple more suggestions? Yeah, always. Okay, we've got axolotls. <gasps> axolotls are great. Axolotls. We've got tangerines. Is that how you spell that? I don't know. Uh, tangerines. no. I don't think there's a Y. There's a Y somewhere it's just in it. T, t L S. As well, the way Ren spe spelt it was A X O L O T L, which is the correct way to do it, I guess. A Mexican salamander that, in natural conditions, retains its aquatic larval form throughout life, but what? is also able to breed. Okay. Tangerines, we have that one. Um, the Tangerine. Drawing Pirates suggests strawberry. Hello, the Drawing Pirates. Haven't seen you here yet, so welcome. Uh, sorry, what was the suggestion? S strawberry. I love strawberries. Then we also have mushrooms and noodles. Ooh, mushroom noodles. Those are enoki mushrooms. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good way to combine it. Uh, we also have apple and porcupine. Apple. Ooh, I am working on a porcupine book right now. I am very good at porcupines at the moment. So, porcupine. And then we've got the nice. lovely capybara. Oh, capybara coming in hot. Better watch out. That's an R-O-U-S. I love them. Uh, also, thank you so much for... All the suggestions. This is lovely. Rain down on well, me. The last suggestion was also from Ibrahim saying, Your doodle of Anthony. <laughs> okay, I'm just going to put Anthony. <laughs> Anthoy. 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 Okay. <laughs> Pretty cool. Why have I never called you Ant Boy? Ant Boy. Ant Boy Boy. I'm going to draw this one, draw, or standing on this one. Oh, it's ladybugs all the way down. <laughs> exactly. <gasps> Wait, if if we do it vertically, like they're just it's ladybugs all the way down. Like it they're yeah. all like, stacked. <gasps> That'd be That's pretty so cute. cute. Yeah. And, and they I don't could, think I've ever seen that. One could be smoking a pipe. <laughs> I don't know. Duh. They're just like Why doing not? things. <laughs> yeah, they're just like doing things, man. I like it. I like where your head's at. Let's do it. <laughs> okay. Smoking a pipe. Um I don't know how. Okay. Just have its little spindly like come up out naturally like a J or something. A J? Yeah. <laughs> Just do that. It's fine. 
Wee wee. <laughs> wee wee. <laughs> wee wee. Oh no. I mean, this is all sketch, so you know, we'll figure it out. <laughs> Truly. Jake Green says pancakes. Pancakes. That's a good one too. Oh, we could do a stack of that. What if we do a vertical thing where it's just like? Oh yeah. Ooh, Washi vertical. tape. Turn it on its head. Tara <laughs> suggests oh, drinking God. tea or an adult beverage. Pancakes. Oh, they're like just adult ladybugs. Like, <gasps> unladylike bugs. <laughs> unladylike oh, bugs. I, like, I kind of like that. That's funny. You could do one dancing Ooh, on top of another one or holding. The... I, don't know. I feel like this is less realistic and more like goofy goofy yeah let's get goofy with it uh what was the other thing tea or drink cool. i just did you just hear that no what was it sorry okay, so turn it our... ah! <laughs> oh too loud oh what sorry <laughs> okay i turned it back was down it me i did that well i thought i was listening to something in the ambient in your room so i was turning it up to hear it but then you started talking and it hurt ah, me no. <laughs> <laughs> no sorry guys i'm confusing everyone uh it was in the song so anthony can't hear it because he's not listening to my desktop uh... audio but it was uh, a sample in the song from this it's stream beats is a free to use streaming kind of thing where it's like uh, non-copyright and we're just talking about video game music. Is it copyrighted or whatever for the use in streams? And the, it just had the little sample that said, hey, listen. No way. <laughs> just Video had game it. music. I was like, what on the head? Oh, my goodness. What on the head? <laughs> how head are the what? How? Rin has a question. Ooh, so how sure. does one have their designs washied? Do you <laughs> order it somewhere? Wash it up. No, you bring it to a fairy fountain in the middle of the forest, and you have to pay them at the goblin parts, but then they make you washi tape. And the yeah. more parts you bring and the different kinds of parts you bring upgrades the washi tape in different ways. Like thicker. It's thicker, stickier. <laughs> yeah. Like there are wider ones where it's like, you know, across. Anyways. Mm -hmm. uh, no, for real Rin, though, uh, it's, yeah, you just find a manufacturer who will print it. And I have not found, found a manufacturer or anything, but I could talk to some some friends. Like, I'm pretty much friends with Leanne at this point, And so I could just ask her, like, hey, let's get qual where you get. Let's get washied. Let's get washied. The drawing pirate says, hey, guys. Wow, y'all so friendly. <laughs> and then crying emoji. It's true. No. It's true. We are I friendly. Mean, well, <laughs> Am I better best. than everyone else? <laughs> <laughs> because I'm friendly. <laughs> Corinne just TikTok? explained that to us. <laughs> question mark <laughs> apparently okay so for those out of the know uh there's a tiktok trend where people just do something and then they ask themselves am i better than everyone else <laughs> <laughs> it's like because you put the shopping cart back where it goes or you put sunscreen, sunscreen yeah. on. <laughs> <laughs> tara says you can sit with us Yes! Uh, oh my gosh, that's so funny. The, the Try Guys have uh, the Try Wives, which uh, that's all. Uh, well, three of them have uh, are married. I believe that Zach got married, and then uh, Eugene has a boyfriend. And the Try Wives, I can't remember if Matt uh, Eugene's boyfriend is part of it all the time. Anyway, so it's three of them, and it's called Can uh, You Can Sit With Us. Ah! Aww, yeah, cute. And apparently, you it's can even sit more with popular us at than the, the Try Cuddle Guys Farm. The Cuddle Farm! Yeah, that was a good episode. That's where I want to go. Alessandra says about ladybugs, I hope so. It's good luck. This ladybug has been in my room for days now. Oh, you've got a, a roommate suddenly. Didn't ask for you it, but here you go. Catch and release. Put it, put it outside. Yeah, so it can eat the aphids. They're good for stuff in the garden. Because yeah. it will be in your room for more days if you don't put it outside it will die in there exactly <laughs> just a beautiful little bug corpse i mean that's what cicadas are leaving everywhere now so it's a thing mm. corpse Sh shell well Carapace. the shells yes but then they're you know corpse show therapist okay <laughs> okay yeah sure Okay, so I think we've got the concept for this one where they're all... Oh, oh, they're going to need, like, hats and stuff. That's true. 
very, very Oh, true. Alessandra says that she did catch it and put it outside, but it came back. Oh, wow. It's persistent. Yeah, I like that. It's like, no. Rin says, be. I don't know. That roommate seems to have a spotty track record. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Ooh, another you. cackle. Do we have a cackle counter? <laughs> Oh, that's what I was thinking with the, the video game talk. Okay, so uh, what I was thinking was when you mentioned cooking durian in Breath of the Wild, there's a sound effect that happens when you're cooking. And I was playing it in my head instantly when you said that. So I thought, what if when Anna is thinking, we just brought up like a little animation that was like a loading sign, but it had that sound effect of like cooking the dish. I feel like people would get tired of hearing it. Muscle. Gotcha. Oh, God, this was so... <laughs> Remember how we were kind? <laughs> <laughs> you can sit with us at your own peril. <laughs> and he's got a bleeded tongue, so just take it for what it is. <laughs> Amiri over on YouTube says, hi! Hello! How are you? You having a good day so far? A Wednesday! What was the other thing you wanted? Oh, sipping tea? Sipping tea, sipping, dipping tea. Or an adult beverage. <clears throat> tea is the most like adult coffee. beverage. coffee. <laughs> <laughs> I'd say. I just got some tea. I was telling you about that. Oh, 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 oh. oh yeah, the new tea. Do you, have yeah. you tried it yet? Do you like it? I tried the one. I haven't tried the second. I gotta try that tonight. Ooh, later it's this tea evening. night tonight, baby. <laughs> yeah. I like to reserve my chamomile for nighttime. <laughs> <laughs> it's sleepy time tea. Party. I should be having I should be having a cup now. Okay. We'll wait. <laughs> it. it will be twelve minutes. I mean it steeps for twelve minutes. You don't have to stand there and watch it. No, that's true, but I have to go boil the kettle oh and get gosh. the thing boil out and the to make the my bread. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh. Okay, wait. Uh, you get the point with this one. Okay. Uh, yeah, what? <laughs> that one's just a rock. Um, the drawing <laughs> pirate says, Anna, your vibe. Uh, <laughs> why didn't I know you exist yet? <laughs> your vibe. <laughs> I send them out into the universe. So why don't you, you subscribe to Patreon and you'll get more Anna vibes? <laughs> Link in the description. <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 yeah. You know, there are links. Anyways, uh, <laughs> I'm glad you're appreciating the vibes, man. Okay, I'm going to pick something <laughs> What for... is it from the Goofy movie? The vibes. What? The Goofy movie? That one guy, the Goofy movie, he's got like oh, orange Oh, I was thinking... Leaning Tower, Tower of Cheesa. Leaning Tower of Cheesa. Yeah, the way um, he talks. Yeah, could I talk like that for the rest of the stream? And then you do Bane. It all works out. <laughs> Uh, what was I going to say, though? Um, when you said the Goofy movie, I immediately thought Scooby Scooby-Doo for some reason. That's Why did that happen? Wrong. Yeah, I think my neurons got messed up. They're, like, connecting to the wrong things. Mystery vehicle. Any who's it? What's it's galore? What's it's galore? <laughs> Thingamabob, I got 20. Hey. I keep starting The Little Mermaid, okay. but only getting halfway through. What's the part you leave at? When I'm hungry. When I'm hungry. We started the sound of music last night. Ooh, the hills we are alive. We paused That's it. A long yeah. Time. Oh, that. Yeah, we got to intermission, and I was like, "Hey, I'm going to bed. It's 11:30." <laughs> I'm a young, la oh, wait, old man. Started there it go. pretty late, but I was looking up um, best surround sound movies to play since I finally figured out my subwoofer. Mm -hmm. Whoops. <laughs> um, <laughs> so that was one that was like a immersive surround sound movie. So mm -hmm. we turned that on and Ashley and I watched it until the intermission and then I went to bed. But I may pick it up tonight for the second half. It's so good. It's the hilarious. Sound of music? Yeah, it, it yeah. works. Um, There's it's... so many great quips. Absolutely. Well, in great songs. I mean, come on. What are you ignoring them? <laughs> Um, but the the first time I saw it uh, was way later than most people. It seems like it seems like one of those like oh everybody's seen it kind of thing. I think it was late middle school that I saw it. Really? Okay, so I saw it when I was like twenty 
or something like that. And it was just because it was randomly on TV. And so I decided I'm going to watch this. And I it was like, I regret this so much because it's so long. <laughs> it's so long, but it's so good. But I feel like the good, pacing yeah. during at least the first half, I don't really remember the second half, but uh, the pacing in the first half, just go, go, go. Indeed. Yes. And and it's... I feel like I know how to sing and Julie Andrews taught me. <laughs> uh, Faso latido, re mi, ma. Tell me, how do, how do you sing? sing? Forgot about for that eighth me. note. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> Come on, sing for me. What is it? Tell me. Do a deer, a, a female, female deer. deer. Ray, a drop do of me, Ray. <laughs> how does it go again? Uh oh. Me, a name I call myself. I call myself. A long, long, a way, long, long way to run. <laughs> Copyright. Uh, <laughs> I don't know if any of those notes were right, but um, yeah, no, me either. the good stuff, the good She's stuff. She's trying to teach me. I, I should clarify. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's all in good yeah. effort, but... Too. And that we could just use drapes as clothes when I we want to have a play outfit to match six other kids. <laughs> I definitely want a play outfit to match six other kids. Are you kidding me? Could we have a gang that goes through the world in drapery that matches? Oh, wow. and they're like Ooh, play sets would, where it's like a shirt called? with shorts. Oof. Oof. Yeah, that would Oof. be good. And then we could run around. Shake Green's with joining else. along with us saying, so a needle pulling thread and la, the one that's after so. <laughs> the one, the one that's after so. Don't you know? I think know? it's a note that to follow. Uh, Jake Green also said about the combo between Goofy Movie, Scooby-Doo. Goofy do! <laughs> it's Goofy perfect. Goofy do, where are you? She's a tower, she's a. Um, Jake says also that he had to work until <laughs> about like 2 a.m. yesterday. Two? I had to finish a 20 minute real type compilation video and get it rendering last night so I could send it out to the client this morning. I'm Whoa. so sorry, Jake. Dang, that's, that's a lot. That's too much. Tell them to give you a break. Hey, man, I need a break. You're breaking me. Hopefully you're on break now. Absolutely. This is your you, break. Well, you shouldn't be working for five days after pulling an all-nighter. That's just the rules, okay? I don't make up the rules, but I can tell you. That's one of them. I want a stack of pancakes on here. That's what I'm going for. It's I, working. I see it. I don't know if it's working. <laughs> no, no, I, I want, see it. First of all, I want them to be more flopsy and stuff. But Whoa. the... Um, the idea that it's against the orange. I might just like drag this over to a different color. Is that madness? It's madness. I kind of like that you're using the background to reveal part of it. But look at it on the little minty blue. It pops. Oh, yeah, that's more. good too. Right? Like a little retro yeah. uh, breakfast. Well, item? who suggested this? Was <laughs> it Jake Green that suggested it? Jake Green, what color would you like these pancakes on top of? Oh, Ooh. we give him yeah. too much power. It'll go straight to his head. I'll stay Whatever. Up till 2 it's perfect. Oh, gotta get the project done. Because <laughs> obviously, he has no sympathy for other creatives. Jake Green says, I'm currently taking my break. <laughs> currently taking your break? Oh my gosh. Wait, how do you watch us? Is it on your phone? On a computer? Where are Whoa. we right now? I'm in a glass case of emotion. <laughs> I want no, to break I, ow. Oh, oh, oh. oh no, the glass I case of emotion. On the glass. Oh, <laughs> From where to where do you feel it? Do you feel it in your pinky All or your the ring way finger? Down, man, it just sucks. Your middle oh, finger? Wiggle your whole arm. <laughs> it's not monkey paws. You yet. do it again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's exactly how I injured myself. <laughs> Oh, I didn't uh, tell you the other day. I caught mm -hmm. a frisbee and it was going too hard and it bruised this part of my thumb like all Whoa. the way around. It was like purple. But Is it still a little? No, I think it's fine. Look uh, at that. Am I fine? Tell me, internet. Am I fine? <laughs> um, <laughs> I I think it's fine. I don't see any grossness under the under the oh wait there's a lit there's a tiny yeah frisbee. there it is yeah, okay there it is yeah purple. there it is anyways be careful with frisbees they're deadly <laughs> dangerous you gotta play it with like a catcher's mitt oh my gosh yes <laughs> i'll never catch it again oh it'll be great no i got it's hit like in the a face ball a just two dimensional bit, uh, when i was a kid have you ever had that happen hit right in the, the face schmoz? with a frisbee yeah. i fell off a bike and hit my face with the handlebar Ooh, 
Oh, I can ride my face with my, no handlebars? What? <laughs> with only handlebars. With all handlebars. Uh, how was it? Are you okay? Were you It was okay? great. Um, <laughs> yeah, I was just really going for that I want to hurt and be in pain type of day. So. Okay, I get it, I get it. <laughs> so you're um, just like, oh. It was that kind of bike that had, you know, on the handlebars, they would kind of like come up as little horns or something like that. <laughs> Oh, I know what you mean. Uh, I think that just like hit me right in the eye. There's a bike Loki with those for his horns, so it's literally like the most apt comparison. There's what now? Sorry. Uh, uh and no spoilers because this isn't a thing that is at all. Sp oh, okay, never mind. I'll I'll keep it to myself. <laughs> I take everything back. There's nothing. There's okay. nothing at all. I just watched the making of Loki on Disney Plus the other night, so I learned a little bit about that's, the, the Oh, design. that's cool. So, yeah, what are they, how long was it? Was it a documentary? Uh, an, hour. an hour and a half? It's very well done. You should watch it for sure. They have one on so all they of go the episode by TVs episode so far. Yeah, each episode. No, uh, well, kind of. Okay, so <laughs> episodes mm -hmm. of this show, uh, I can't remember what it's called, but it's on Disney Plus. I think it's something like Making of Blah Blah Blah, something like that. And they've done WandaVision, uh, Winter Soldier, and uh, Falcon. What was that called? It was the. It wasn't the, the Falcon, Falcon and the Winter. Soldier. I think the, they made a point of not saying it's it's not the Falcon. Oh, it's just Falcon. Falcon and the Winter Soldier. I there never watched go. it. You didn't watch it. No, I kind of like the ones that are more magically or fantasy, and that one doesn't feel that way to me. Okay. Uh, the, right? It's not uh, definitely magical not. Yeah, and yeah, fantasy. Yeah. I mean, there's right? like stuff that doesn't exist in our world, but definitely not to the. It's not like WandaVision. Um, but yeah, the the uh, third one is loki and it's a whole uh hour and they have like voiceover from tom hiddleston stuff it's great cool mm -hmm. um Little there's a new episode Peter. of what if out tonight i think <gasps> i know what i'm watching also just to jump back into chat real quick jake green says about going to bed at 2 a.m that's not an all-nighter that's my normal bedtime ah uh and jake. um jake also says i like the color it's on and tuning in from my computer usually i did that on the bathroom door earlier about hitting funny bones and oh, speaking of unreasonably darn. painful things i had a brain freeze today no oh, you gotta lick no. the roof of your mouth just use the, your tongue and try to just like massage your hard palate <laughs> Massage your hard palate. Tips from the street. And make Linda Belcher noises. <laughs> That's how you do it. <laughs> it's good. It feels good to do. Anna, try that Deep real breath. quick. No, it actually... I baned for you. <laughs> you Linda Belcher for me now. <laughs> I love you, but no. Uh... Come on. <laughs> no, the thing is, when I do that, it tickles the roof of my mouth, and I hate it. I hate it so oh, bad. Oh, okay. Well, it's there's a reason. It's real weird. Then. I don't like okay. it. Okay. Well, can you, um, you think I don't have say something to me as request. Bane while I do the Linda Belcher thing? Oh, like, that's I know a exactly really good Linda Belcher impersonation. Oh, that's hip hop. <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> Wait, is that what she says? Or, now, that's what I call hip hop. <laughs> no, I can do it better. Okay. Uh, no, it's just now that's hip hop because the other oh, one's okay. the music CD compilation thingy. <laughs> so it's either Linda Belcher or commercials from the nineties. Okay, there's no in between. I gotcha. I gotcha. Speaking of Seinfeld's coming to Netflix okay. October first. <laughs> Perfectly <laughs> in time for Halloween. <laughs> Watch it all. Speaking um, of which, Elaine is in uh, Falcon and Winter Soldier. No way. Yas way. I think Elaine, which is Julia Dreyfus Julia in Louise real Dreyfus. life. Yes. Julia Louise Dreyfus also played the mom in um oh. Onward? Is that what that movie was called? I could believe that. From Pixar? Yeah. I don't remember specifically her voice doing that, but I could believe it for sure. Yeah. Um By the That way. was like the best part of that movie. Oh my gosh. Wow, strong opinions. Um, by the way, uh, I want or to I just really to love you, Julia Anthony. Louis Dreyfus. Oh, don't we all? Are you kidding me? Um, but there is going to be a Lightbox uh, panel of Vigil versus the Machines with the. Creators. Oh, is Abby Jacob? 
Abby Jacobson going to be on it? I don't know, but I'm excited. Speaking of uh, Abby Jacobson and Bob's Burgers, the latest episode I watched, she played one of, or she voiced one of the characters. Oh, really? Yeah, I was like, that's Abby Jacobson. Yeah. I love her. I, I love her. It's not like She's it's great. love. Yeah. That's great. I'm glad you're happy. Um, Jake Green says, and I don't remember to what, but it was good. But I agree, Anthony. And then Rin says back, and Jake <laughs> says front. And then um, Anonymous said so right. <laughs> but I don't, what, in reference to what? <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, I get it. I always get it. There's what a car are you talking outside about? that's backing up. I'm so sorry. It's going to be doing oh. it forever. Um, Anonymous says the What If episode came out in Australia yesterday. Ah, oh, what is time? That's so cool. Have you seen it, Anonymous? No spoilers, but have you seen it? And Jake Green says the Matrix trailer tomorrow. Tomorrow. Are you very excited, Jake? Are you ready for this? Are you going to take the red pill or the blue pill? What are you going to do? You know how excited Jake Green is? He went to the teaser website and compiled all of the different clips from the teaser website into like a minute long trailer on YouTube. Are you kidding me? Jake. No, I posted amazing. it to Discord. Oh on my the gosh, I haven't channel. seen it yet. Ugh, I need he posted to it to Twitter. By the way, I made these uh, pancakes kind of zero gravity for a second, and then I'm going to stack them again up here. Yeah, do you like it? Oh, sorry. I was looking at Discord. How dare you? Yeah, those are great. Great pancakes. Really flipping my jack. <laughs> I don't want that. I don't know <laughs> if I like it. I Jake Green says he tried licking the roof of his mouth, but it didn't help. During a brain freeze. Um, gotcha. Rin okay. says, I like these amazing stacks of pancakes. Stack and Jake Green says, who likes hip hop? Quote, unquote. <laughs> Is that a quote? <laughs> Uh, it was, I guess. Uh, Jake Green says, he says that in the Aural Knots video I mentioned earlier. What's that? I don't know. I'm very <laughs> out of any kind of zeitgeist. You guys are the parents. I don't know. <laughs> I ain't zeitgeist anything, man. Is that my name still? Well, my name's Anthony now. <laughs> no, my name's Anthony now. I changed it way back when. Um... Uh, Alessandra says, I'm so watching Seinfeld. And Jake Green says, oh, was that her? That's cool. Awesome. About Julia Louise Dreyfus. Yeah, yeah, baby. I'm pretty sure it was her. Yeah. In Onward. Or Onward? in Fal Falcon and the Winter Soldier. <laughs> I oh. talk normally. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Jake Green says, I love these pen cookies. Uh, the pen cookies. <laughs> Have you ever had, um, oh golly, Stroop waffles? Yeah. Those are quite delightful. I would enjoy that on a nice sunny day or a winter's afternoon, indeed. Where did you have one? Verily, verily. Uh, the place I used to work, they actually brought it in uh, one day as just like a random, oh, we saw this at the bakery and got some. And I was like, <laughs> they're so good. <laughs> wow. Stroop waffles. Stroop waffles. Do, 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 do. By the way, I'm just drinking my frozen mocha over here. Mm. There's like a press you could buy to make those at home. It's kind of like a pancake press, but small. But the other thing about that is it has like that caramely layer, right? Yeah, they're very sugar laden. So I think they would definitely be just a treat that I buy. But, um, you know, honestly, I might consider getting some kind of press in the future for ice cream cones because I make ice cream, but we've never had it with cones. Because Ooh, a stroopwaffle thing would be perfect. Except you don't have room for something so industrial looking. Not in this kitchen, but maybe in the future when I have a lavishly future large kitchen and many copious kitchen. islands. Ah, <laughs> Um, Ooh, syrup. Now that's Anonymous is asking if we've seen Black Widow or Cruella. I have seen neither, actually. Uh, Black Widow is still behind the uh, premium access. I'm considering... Oh, James said no, but <laughs> I would consider uh, Shang-Chi, the Ten Rings. Uh, I was asking him, should we buy it when it comes out on streaming? And I've heard so many good things about it right now because everybody seems to just love it. They're like, this is the best Marvel movie in a really long time. Not only are the characters lovable, but the action scenes are outrageous. 
And so I was like, would we possibly get that? And he was like, nah. <laughs> but uh, I think it really depends on the price. If it's something like $30, I don't think we could justify that for just two people seeing it. But um, anyways, yeah, I think good good things have been heard so far. If anybody's seen it, again, no spoilers, but let me know. How did it go? Alessandra's saying that we need to watch Vivo on Netflix. Oh, yeah, I've uh, heard of that. That's the one with the little monkey guy, right? I think so, baby. yeah. It says, Vivo, Sony Pictures Animation's first ever musical adventure featuring all new original songs from Lin-Manuel Miranda will take audiences on an epic adventure to gorgeous and vibrant locations never before seen in animation. Nice. Uh, Vivo follows a one-of-a-kind kinkajou. <gasps> no, he's a kinkajou? That's so funny. You That's were just amazing. talking about how you I liked love kinkajous, kinkajous yeah. on Monday. One of my favorite animals growing up. Well, we gotta watch this movie then, huh? Jay Green says, Falcon and the Winter Soldier was good, Anthony, but I agree about the magical, mystical elements. And then goes on to say, I did! Flapping, flapping my jack. Anonymous <laughs> says, we have a new record for YouTube likes. Yay! Oh, thank you It's so six. Oh, yeah. it's seven oh on YouTube. Oh my gosh, you guys I don't know how many people it. liked it on Behance. <laughs> Because I can't see the number anymore, but 79 people are watching. What if they all press that button? Indeed. Oh, <laughs> it's a challenge. Help us break a Guinness World Book record <laughs> for Anna's thumbs up on Beans. Yes, because that's a, a part of it. The Guinness Book of World Records is just waiting, waiting <laughs> with bated breath. Like, oh, what's going to happen? They're actually uh, Guinness World's Book of Records is in the chat and is oh my going goodness. to be the Hello last Guinness. person to push the oh button to make it go over. So everybody button. else has to push it first and then the final push. I think Behance would just like implode if 79 people liked a video at the same time. Just be like, <laughs> what is happening? So try it's it. I want to see what happens. Yeah, <laughs> break <laughs> Behance. But it's true. I can't see how many people appreciate the videos anymore. So I can't nag you guys to do it. <laughs> <laughs> so sad. Uh, but we could nag you to go over to YouTube and do it. Here, I'll post a link in the chat if anybody cares. <laughs> oh my gosh, so silly. We could see those thumbs. Oh, Ibrahim says 21 likes on Behance at the moment. Ooh, How do you maybe see I them? guess I can't even it's see on them. mobile. That's madness. Are you on mobile, Ibrahim? I'm on mobile right now, Anthony. You don't even know. I'm Whoa. on my phone. I'm not even painting. I recorded Whoa. this earlier. <laughs> I'm Whoa. just hanging out Perfectly in timed. right now. How did you know what I would say? <laughs> um, Anonymous says, Cruella is free from Premier Access now in Australia. Not Hi. sure about America. <laughs> and Rin says, I'm a bit leery of Cruella. It gives me weird vibes. Hmm. Question mark. I'm curious, but feel like I have, I'll have to be in the right headspace. Um, and Jake Green says, I want to see Shang-Chi so bad. It will definitely, I will definitely be getting it. It will be $30. It will be $30. That makes more this sense because you have more people to watch it with you. Oh my Even gosh, here, you like split between roommates, like it would be $10 each of, or less than that. Mm -hmm. uh, like seven each. How does math work? Is that right? $6.33 <laughs> each? You're asking me how math works? <laughs> Uh, if we were gonna... I do not do any math. <laughs> I only do impressions. That was kind of Zay Frank instead of Bane. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> Who's Zay Frank? Uh, the, the the dude that does the like uh oh golly uh animals like th that is how the honey badger do or uh oh the, the, right the sad cat diaries like yeah 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 day thirty seven you know <laughs> should Bane have one of those. Should Bane have one of those? Yeah. Should Bane make sad cat diaries? Uh-huh. <laughs> but related to Gotham somehow, however, so I don't know. However, Maybe he's following. Wait, wait, wait. You've mm. seen Bane Cat, right? It sounds familiar. The hesitation yeah. is killing me. I feel like this should be buried in your... Buried? Buried. 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 It should be it should be ingrained in your brainscape, you know, like the fibers of oh. your brain stuff. It should just be like right up in there as Bane cat. Yeah, I think the word for that is buried. <laughs> Stop looking me straight. 
mischievously around, you little scamp. Okay, so <laughs> watch Bane Cat on YouTube. It's the best thing you'll ever do with your life. It's so good. Okay. Okay, he's leaving, I guess. <laughs> oh, it's got like a whole mask on it. <laughs> yeah. A trouble making cat named Peanut. Bane Cat, episode <laughs> one. This came out March 24th, 2014. Uh, yeah, duh. History was made that day. <laughs> I'm just considering what this would look like if it were stacks on stacks on stacks on stacks. <laughs> it's funny. It could be improved for sure, but it's, uh, it's, the idea is there. Okay, I went a little too far with the idea. It should have been just, like, a sketch, but... Whoa, Anyways. that's a lot of pancakes. Yeah, would you put it on your uh, something as a tape? I feel like it's too... Uh, yeah, my flower. I could use it to keep the flap down. What? Oh, the fl flower F-L-O-U-R. Oh, no, I'm going to tape all the petals down. <laughs> Those, I call petals flaps. I just want to washi tape all of them to the stalk. <laughs> the I don't like how they spread flower. out. Yeah. <laughs> but I still want it to be cute, so I'm going to use washi tape to <laughs> mm -hmm, yeah, exactly. But the pancake oh, ones. Oh, he's a special one. Um, yeah, so I think this is probably too complex for washi tape when you consider how small it's printed. Like, it's going to be that little bebe size. So I'm going to make it the same size on my screen. Yeah, that's about the same size on my screen now of what it would be physically. That doesn't help any of you because your screen is probably a totally different size than mine. But anyways, um... That would be very small, so I think I'd have to reconsider the actual artwork for it, but the concept is there, which this, the concept is cool. I like it. Abraham says, and it's 20 thumbs ups now. Someone just unliked it, lol. And yes, I'm on mobile. <laughs> I appreciate whoever Okay, let's see. It very let's much. see if we could get like it down to pain. zero again. Let's everyone unlike <laughs> it. And then we'll see if that does something. It's a great But experiment. then like it again. Just keep pushing it on and off throughout the entire video. Wait, when you do that, it gives you weird notifications, doesn't it? <laughs> this is for you, Jake. Lap. Oh, Lap. I'm doing Lap. it. How many times Flap has been said today? Hmm. He likes it. True facts about Flap. I'm going to do crows on uh, this next one. I really enjoy crows. The Drawing Pirate asks a random question. Hey, a Do you guys answer. know about Kid Cosmic, the Netflix series? 24. That was my random answer. Yes, I know Kid Cosmic, and it just came out with another season. We're going to watch it during lunch. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it just came out today? Uh, I think James said that, yeah. He read something about it being... It was either today or yesterday or something like that. That's got a really lovely art style. It does, and I just, I enjoy all the characters and everything. It's it's a pretty cute show. I would recommend. This is a crow. Did you not know? That's a crow. Mm, no. Yeah, that's a crow. Beep, beep, beep. Back it up, back it up. You got it. It looks like Garfield's it. fur. The squiggles you oh, have are yeah. perfect for okay. it. Okay. Yeah. Garfield, then. I think this is how they do them. I don't think they're like... Drawing Pirate says, it's amazing this indeed. No. Oh, it is amazing. I appreciate that it's you It's like a bear or something. John. John. Okay, it's Garfield <laughs> now. <laughs> Lasagna. I think he's got like little poofs. This is why it's okay to reference, guys. Never be No, scared, draw from your memory. We should some, do that on... Uh... Sometimes you think you're bad at drawing, but it's really just... Use reference. That's fine. <laughs> what are you trying to say, Anthony? Uh, Anthony, say it to my face. Well, I just want you to kind of read Anthony. between the washi tape lines. <laughs> take everything back. It's not Garfield. It's not Garfield at all. I can never do Garfield justice. No justice for Your words, not mine. Drawing Pirate says, OMG, it's out. Thanks for telling me. Yes. Yes, it is. Jay Green says, I watched oh, a really God. interesting video about crows and their mimic abilities. Mimic you. Oh my gosh, is that where they got the idea for the Pokemon? 
<laughs> but yeah. Uh... Wait, who was the person that sent us the video of this is what it would sound like if a monkey could talk? I don't know that one. What are you talking about? What? You don't? I don't remember that. What would a monkey talk like? It was when we were doing wedding voices. <laughs> Yeah, and then someone in Discord, it might have been Jake, Kendall, or Joe. This is I a think. recent thing, and they were talking about how a monkey could talk? Oh, yeah, it was Jake Green, and that was me, he says. And about uh, crows. Oh, wait, it was ravens. Quote the raven. But, yeah, it was uh, a monkey, and if it could vocalize like a human, it would sound like our wedding voices, too. Are you kidding me? Really? No, I just totally missed time. that, apparently. Dang. Uh, well, I watched it, like, three times, then I showed Ashley. I've never seen it. Okay, yeah, it was on August 25th. It's, like, a few scrolls up in the videos channel on Discord. It says, this video starts with that simulated monkey voice y'all invertedly imitated during today's stream. Also an interesting video. And right before that, I posted, when you eat food you're not used to. <laughs> That's why I didn't see it because you were distracting me with It ain't familiar It ain't familiar <laughs> <laughs> By the way it's we funny. have a discord It's full of fun stuff Go check out the videos tab if you want nonsense in your life <laughs> oh. <laughs> If this wasn't enough <laughs> Hello my ragtime <laughs> gal um, By Aww. the way on Ryan's stream uh, He just once again showed the Wiggles rainbow sponges video And it just made me laugh out loud once again It was so good <sighs> You remember what I'm talking about right? Ryan's video what happened? Are you listening to nothing? I wasn't <laughs> I was reading <laughs> something okay I understand <laughs> Um, okay, are you listening now? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's yes. kind of a prere prerequisite for me talking. Um, so... Is it, though? Yeah! Sometimes you talk all the time. <laughs> I do. I get it. I, I'm not blaming you, but I'm just saying. Anyways, uh, yeah, Ryan yeah, yeah. was showing a video on a stream, and he was talking about doing a rainbow as a pattern. And then uh, I believe it was Randall came in with, make a rainbow brush, make a rainbow brush, make a rainbow brush. And then Ryan was like, you know what this needs. And he brought up the video of the lady being like, rainbow oh, yeah. sponges, wiggles, wiggles, <laughs> wiggles. Ah, I love it. Ah! It's so good. It's so good. That video is a must see. So if you don't know what I'm talking about, we need to post it again and like get everybody's And I scrubbed. It. And I scrubbed. <laughs> this is a night I didn't sleep. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> And you just can't No stop. flab on this arm. <laughs> flab on this arm. <laughs> so good. I love her. And the part so where she much. talks about, like, recently I was contracted by the military. I was like, what? That's how the video starts. <laughs> She's... The enthusiasm. I, I it aspire. reminds me of Shay. Oh, I just feel so like that's good. a... Shay when she's older. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, we should get her some sponges. <laughs> Sponge worthy. <laughs> Speaking of Seinfeld, <laughs> it's more inappropriate than you know. <laughs> I watched Seinfeld like exclusively when I was growing up, basically, so I know all the references. If y'all want to throw any out, I get it. I get it. Speaking of throwing things out, no soup for you, huh? <laughs> no soup for you. Next. I haven't seen the full thing, so I'll have to watch it. All of the episodes. I'm sure they haven't all aged well, but I still have a deep love. <laughs> um, what was I gonna say? Oh, my parents and I. Oh my gosh, all the references. But like, if you watch an entire show with your parents, that's the best time for like just reference on reference on reference on reference. It's the best. Or movies, Evil Under the Sun. Oh my I'm gosh! In that club now. <laughs> I just watched a video about the um, the making of like kind of behind the scenes of Clue, and yeah, yeah apparently it was not well received in theaters. <laughs> it got really bad oh. reviews, and everybody was like, "These jokes are awkward." And apparently, Madeline Kahn <laughs> doing the flames coming off my face was completely improv, and it was like the only improv in the movie. I mean, it felt a little improv, not gonna lie. <laughs> But it was also the best part of the it entire movie. It was absolutely movie. hands down the best part. <laughs> I love it so much. What a treasure. She really is. Um, 
Rin says the loveliest of nonsense, and Anthony Jackson says nonsense is what the world needs, and Anonymous says nonsense is the sense of none. And Jake Green says, oh, I just realized you were talking about the rainbow sponge lady. Yes. And Anthony Jackson says, speaking of Seinfeld, <laughs> monkey paws time. We're at five o'clock. Monkey, monkey, monkey. Pa, pa, pa. Pa, pa, pa. Hey, if you're new here, we do a hand stretch together. And so I'm going to give you the instructions, and you just follow along to give yourself a little break. We're all sitting at computers or at our phones or whatever, and we need to, like, detach a little bit, okay? So, ooh, first extend your arms and crack your elbows, mister. Whoa. My elbows don't crack, but my wrists and fingers do. Wow, the way you said that. (laughs) Sounded proud? I don't know. Uh. I just remembered I'm wearing glasses, because you are. (laughs) Anyways. (laughs) I made your eyes bad. Apparently... I give in to peer pressure without even trying. Okay, so... Peer ah! pressure. Yeah 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 yeah, 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 You see what I'm doing? Uh, okay, anyways. So to start, we're going to put our arms straight out in front of ourselves. We're going to put our palms facing away from us and fingers to the sky. And then when oh. we are oh, in this position, oh. we are going to curl our fingers into what we call a monkey paw. Ooh, ooh, ah, ooh, ah. ah, ah. Good job. Thanks. <laughs> And then the next position is we put our fingers to the ground, palms towards ourselves, and then we curl our fingers in. Ooh, ooh, ah, ah. Ooh, ooh, ah, ah. Good job. And then we flip our hands around, palms away, and fingers down, and then curl our fingers in. Ooh, ooh, ah, ah. Ooh, ooh, ah, ah. Great job. And the fourth pose is fingers to the sky, palms towards ourselves, and then curl our fingers in. Ooh, ooh, ah, ah. Ooh, ooh, ah, ah. Then you try to fight Anthony. Hey, put hey, him up, put him up. Hey, hey, hey. Looking over here with the cuss. Well. I'm cussing at me, I'll cuss up your family. <laughs> and then we repeat these poses, holding for about a second each, and we will repeat this around ten times. And during this time, we should probably close our eyes to give ourselves a break from the screen visually. Oh. All that light coming at us. What? Oh. Don't look. Don't look. Oh. <laughs> I know you want to, but you shouldn't. Oh, you cheater. I know you're looking. I wasn't peeping. I was popping. Um. My wrist popped. <laughs> he's peeping and he's popping and he's... Oh, wait. He's oh. He's peeping and he's popping. What's that? What? The Adam family? Oh, I opened my eyes. I thought oh you were my looking gosh. at me to tell me of something. No. Uh, you should ask the me The Adam's family. Family. <laughs> Is that what came to mind for you? Because I was like, he's peeping. Oh, wait. It's... The, they're, oh, they're creepy and they're spooky. They're, they're spooky. all together. They're all kooky. together, kooky. Oh, kooky? Kooky? I don't know. Kooky, Chris. <laughs> Did you ever cereal. try that? I never oh, yeah. got to try it. Oh, Not I opened good. my eyes. I knew it! <laughs> Hoping that there would be cookie Chris. <laughs> and uh, surprise! <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh, no, no, no. Uh, hey, I'm done with this. Oh, okay. Well, jeez, <laughs> the eyes closed or the hands? <laughs> Yep. How dare you? Just all you just stop it. when you're tired, everyone. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> absolutely. <laughs> the Drawing Pirates, I just appreciate you so much. Your enthusiasm oh. reminds me of the sponge lady. <laughs> you do stretching. You guys are on a whole different level. <laughs> <laughs> Three emojis. Emoji, Three. emoji. Three separate emotions in one. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> All right, so when we're done, we're just going to gently shake out our hands to loosen them back up. Ooh, make ghost noises, because it's the spooky season now, y'all. Ooh. And then we do a few shoulder rolls to loosen back up. Ooh, 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 dance it, dance it, dance it. And then, neck stretches. Try to get your ear as high as possible on each side. Way up in the sky. Listen to the burbs. I really don't like this song. I'm going to skip it. What you is can't it? stop me. It's San Andreas on this uh, playlist. And it's like, whoa, 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 like five million times. It's just the repetition. I think the Killers is coming out with a new album this fall. No way. Gotta tell my is that friend. right? Am I lying to you? Why would you lie to me? <laughs> <laughs> to make you happier. Ah! I need to put my hair up. My neck is so hot. Oh my gosh. And then, and then, once we've done the side to side, uh, ear up in the air stretch, (laughs) (laughs) then we are going to look side to side as far as your head can comfortably turn. To the right. Wait, they came out with an album last year. What? Did you? you, (laughs) What? (laughs) 
Are imploding the Mirage. Me? Oh yeah, I listened or to that. August 21st, better? almost a, all over a year ago. Man. Pressure Machine comes out. Came out August 13th. Uh -oh. oh my gosh, we got stuff to listen to. Two albums, boy. Oh my goodness. We got a lot of catching up to do. <laughs> All right, now we are done with our stretches. Remember to stretch out your leg noodles, get them moving, uh, drink some water, stay hydrated, yeah, and just generally take care of yourself. If you don't like the stretches that we do, then definitely look up some stretches for you, whatever fits your body and doesn't make you hurt. If you feel any pain, yeah. that is a sign from Consult your body your to Consult your physician stop. before attempting any of these stretches. That's what my yoga tea told me the other day. Consult your <laughs> and, uh, physician before I moving. I posted something for you on Discord. Oh my. It's a surprise. Wait, is it in the message? <laughs> I opened my eyes and what did I see? Bippity boppity boo. Alakazuma. Dark Hours oh, wait, is I here can't... too. <laughs> I'm not showing my Cintiq. There we go. Ah, Kookie Chris. <laughs> Kookie Chris. <laughs> that mascot looks different than how I remember He looks him. different, right? Yeah. I don't. Hmm. I don't but know how long change. ago did this serial... How long was it out to be revamped with a new mascot? Also, where are his legs? Uh, the, oh, I the guess you could still buy it. And yet he is not grounded. Pretty Chris, 19. Questions, nice. questions. Uh, and also, out of all the the serial mascots, like what makes it stick out in your head? Did you guys just see that? That flash that my browser did? I think Chrome is just like, <laughs> get out of here, girl. Anyways, uh, he, I don't know, for some reason, maybe they should have made him into, like, a color instead of a gray wolf. I mean, I love a good gray wolf, but maybe not oh, as a mascot. Yeah. In fact, gray wolves were my favorite animal growing up. Uh, I loved wolves, and my sister loved lions. That was kind of our thing. When my brother was born, my parents gave us each stuffed animals of those respective animals. Okay, so I got a wolf, and she got a lion. It was great. That's how you do it, man. When there's a new sip. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Anthony's sending everything. Okay, 90s commercials. Let's see what they got. Okay, wait. Should I not play sound? Should I play sound? The sound is such a big part of it. Especially at the oh, end. Wait, this is, I have the site muted. So that you guys don't get notification sounds every two seconds. Okay. And I say okay, that's a little loud, right? It's so loud? I don't know. Oh, see? Yeah, it was a little loud. See? What is happening with my browser? Yeah, I don't know. Come on, come back, come back. You can do it. You can do it. I'm just gonna refresh. <sighs> Slow on it. Wait. Okay. All right, cookie crisp. Cookies for breakfast? Time out. Uh oh. See, I make the calls, and this I is the mess. Oh yeah. Oh, oh this is the Whoever says cookies are for breakfast yeah. hasn't tried oh, cookie oh, crisp oh, cereal. Oh, it's the only cereal that tastes That's like real it, chocolate chip cookies and is a chocolatey part of this good breakfast. Ooh, so what you call now, Walt? Dog call now, Walt? Doggone good cookies for breakfast! So after the cookie hit, he decides. And is a chocolatey. Okay, so wait. Second thought. I just am curious what this well-rounded breakfast is. So we've got milk. We've got some kind of unknown yellow liquid that's slightly That's orange juice or apples juice. Apples juice. I think it would apples have to be apple just... because it's like you can see through the glass. Um, a bowl of cereal, clearly. And then the box of cereal, which begs the question, how many bowls are you going to pour yourself? Because we all know the trick. Two you have too much two. cereal, not enough milk. Put a little bit more milk in. Oh, no, too much milk, not enough cereal. Go put more cereal in. <laughs> Sooner or later. <laughs> Where'd the cereal go? Uh, oh, and then wow. a muffin. Yeah. A muffin. This is your well-rounded breakfast. Cookies it's, for breakfast. Yep. Yeah. The bowl is round, the muffin's round. Live your That's truth, That's what make it, <laughs> makes it well-rounded. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> oh, I appreciate it. Oh my gosh. Uh, well, I really want cookie crisp now, so let's get some. Yeah? Sound good? <laughs> Sounds great, except we have to eat it with a wolf mascot now. Uh, Jake Green says, the yellow water is the most important. The glass is around from a certain point of view. <laughs> the glass is around. <laughs> See? It's all well-rounded. Well-rounded. so clever. <laughs> smart Alex. Smart Alex in the chat. Uh, but yeah, I, I never got to experience... I don't think I got to experience Cookie Crisp as a kid. 
so sad. But I mean, not reviews. often. I think our go-to um, O's. My mom liked that cereal brand, you so we had that a lot. You turned me on O's, and it was the best of my it's life. So it's so good. Um, it's probably bad for you in every single way, but <laughs> breakfast is dessert. Breakfast is a dessert in America, so that's fine. Everything's a dessert in America. It's been a backwards kind of yeah. century, so you gotta start with dessert. <laughs> it's like that line in Ponyo. Yes. Let's start with dessert because it's been a backwards kind of day. Just like when she's Lim Liz Lemon and then she has a milk mustache and it's just like, oh, yes, eat cereal for every meal. Mm -hmm. um, but then also Honey Bunches of Oats, Fruity Pebbles, and Kicks, I think I remember the most. That's solid, yeah. Um, I think a well-rounded one might say. <laughs> <laughs> Jake's quoting Ponyo, the best line. I like ham. I believe it's I love ham, or I don't know, maybe, or just ham. It could escalate. Yeah, I mean, she definitely screams about ham a lot There's during a lot that of sequence. Ham stuff. Uh, if you haven't seen Ponyo, definitely watch that. One. So good. Jake Green says kicks were entirely round. <laughs> <laughs> You're still on this kick. <laughs> oh, man. But yeah, uh, kicks were one of Aaron's favorites. So I experienced cereal through my sister. Basically, uh, she was the one who loved it. And yeah. I would just eat what she ate because she ate she's cool because she's my older sister. And so kicks and um, later Cinnamon Toast Crunch were like the big ones in the household. And this was into like past high school and everything. Like Aaron would always make sure there was cinnamon toast crunch in the house and i'm sure at her house right now she's got a, a box waiting i suppose i should mention that those name brand ones that we got were like specialty ones that we would get because normally we would get the giant bags from winco or whatever like the store yeah, generic, generic version was totally. so we had marshmallow mateys instead yeah. of oh, lucky man, charms <laughs> which did you then... find there was a big difference between the generic and the name brand um, yeah, I mean, the other name brand one felt like fluffier and crunchier, like it had more texture, quality mm. texture to it, where the other ones were not as quality and like the shapes were Turn all mouth, off. Like, textures and... don't matter. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, not that the name brand one is good for you anyway, so oh, if totally. you're going to get the generic one, it's whatever. Uh, you guys should be eating like good things for breakfast and not sugar what you want our chat to be like healthy and stuff nah i mean part of it is feeding your soul too so if you really want a cereal you go for it but uh i haven't eaten um, cereal in many a year i think the last time good. i ate it was in rice crispy treat form <laughs> which is think, much healthier <laughs> yeah for breakfast this morning i had uh plain greek yogurt mixed with cinnamon and made a uh, tahini sauce with mm. honey okay and you then fancy. cut up some dates and almonds and then drizzled the tahini sauce on top and then um, sprinkled some roasted sesame seeds on top yeah that's way fancy and also probably labor intensive not really it took like five minutes maybe okay not too bad not too bad less time than to make tea am i right <laughs> Am I right? But that's uh, one of the Mediterranean <laughs> recipes I was trying from the Mediterranean cookbook. Yeah, I got. which is very fascinating. I, I would never put those things together, so it makes sense. Oh, did I say there was also banana in it? There was also Ooh, banana what? sliced up. Okay, there it is. Oh so there's like a parfait minus granola. Does Is granola in parfaits? Uh, it could be, yeah. Yeah, it's kind of like a parfait. Parfait's delicious. Oh my gosh, I didn't turn off uh, the notifications. Sorry, I didn't mute the site. Discord. Mute. Discord. Mute. Mute. Discord. Mute. But also, welcome to Jaslyn, who just joined the Discord. Woof, 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 woof. Welcome. <laughs> uh, Jake Green says, I need to get some O's. Yes, they're so good. And Cinnamon Life Smacks. I still get Marshmallow Mateys. Can't forget Captain Crunch. That one that came with a video game. I think that's when we got one of the like oh, name snacks? brand one. It came with like a no Captain Crunch. It came with this video game? PC game. What? Yeah. Was it like themed for Captain the thing? Crunch. The... Yeah. 
It was something okay. to do with like the fairy monsters or something. That's amazing. Okay, if they actually made their own game, that's props to them. They did, and I played it a lot. Wow. PC games, that was also a time. Whew. You could create your own creature. Or disc ROM games, I should say. Uh, you can make your own creature? That's ahead of its time. What the heck? When did this come out? It's available on Amazon, I guess. Oh, get That's it. Weird. We should play it on stream. <laughs> uh, what should we call it? What was it? Oh, uh, sorry. Disc ROM games reminded me of uh, Where in the World is Carmen Sandiego? That's the one I had, and I never finished it, but it was real fun. Mm -hmm. This one's called Captain Crunch Crun Crutchling Adventure. What was that again? <laughs> Take it from the top. Captain Crunch Crunchling Adventure. The characters you play are called Crunchling. Oh, I like that. It feels very uh, puppety, like Jim Henson. What was that? Fraggle Rock. Crunchlings. Fraggle Rock. Yeah. Okay, sure. I'll take your word for it. Um, by the way, in Carmen San Diego, they called you Gumshoe. Uh, nobody cares, but I just wanted to tell you. No, I feel like you've told me that before. Gumshoe, can you solve it? I'm gonna send you uh, someone reviewing this game for a later viewing. I can't wait. I have for to view it the now. Current viewing. <laughs> yeah, I mean you could. I don't know what he says in it though. But he talks about some of the game's mechanics, and they're weird. All right, here's our crow one so far. Um, let's see. Oh, oh, you know what we could do in the background of the crow one? You know how crows like to um, collect things? We could have something fun, like a little uh, string running through it of a different color. They love shiny things. They have to shiny, be shiny things. You want things. it to be like... Well, I mean, it could be like gold ribbon or something. I like to do this with patterns and stuff, is like intertwining it with a, a through line, literally. <laughs> yeah, that's good. Maybe you could put like little white parts on it that yeah, makes it totally. look like it's like glinting. Glint? Glint? Yeah. We could even do like a little zhuzh. Ooh, I love zhuzhes. Yeah. Ooh, this looks very Halloween. Yeah. I love it. Ooh. Very fall. Very fall. Very fall. <laughs> Who wants to be? Sick? Alessandra's asking, <laughs> um, "What cray crayon should I use? I just got a pack and posted it on Discord. Ooh, what channel did you up. post that on? I don't know where to look. Show and tell, maybe. Yes, it's show and tell. Oh, yeah. Found it. Uh, awesome. What should you try first? Oh, the, okay, cosmic. So Unicorn colored, which is rainbowy, metallic. You could do some kid cosmic fan art with the cosmic crayons. That would be fun. Absolutely. Uh, pastel crayons, cosmic crayons, pearl crayons, and neon crayons. I'm going to need a sheet that samples every single one of them so I can see what you're actually working with. I think that would be very satisfying. Very satisfying indeed. Could you do that for me, Alessandra? No pressure. No pressure. <laughs> Uh, Papa Zeitgeist slash Jake says, those sound like really cool crayons. I wonder what they actually look like on paper. Same here. Great thinkers think the things. Yeah. Quote. <laughs> Jake Green says, I have been reading Frog and Toad to my daughter. And last night we read The Lost Button. The Lost Button? Where did that button go? I don't think I... One of these crows has it. Ah, Put it in one of the crows. That's mouth. true. And then we're going to show it to your daughter and be like, there it is. And Rin says, oh, yes, yes, very autumn-y. Much love. Much love, indeed. Yes, I love autumnal. Let's make all the autumn leaves. As what autumn color was the button from the frog and the toad? We want to make sure we're doing it accurately. <laughs> was it green? Jake green? I don't know. Whoa, 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 whoa. A little button. Oh! <laughs> don't know why. I don't know how. But I know something's starting right now. Jake Green says, spoilers, Toad dropped it in his house and then went on a tirade all over the wilderness looking for his lost button. Where my button at? Where it at? 
You got it? You steal it. Do you remember the color of the last button? Or did he ever find it? We shall see. But also, um, did you ever get to read Frog and Toad stories, Anthony? Um, did I? Whoa, something just happened to your audio. It was like a ghost was between you and your mic. Can I? <laughs> Ooh, spooky times. <laughs> Who is it this time? Roger. What color is that button? I think it's gold. Uh, well, perfect. That goes with everything. The golden button. The golden button. The golden button. Or maybe all not. Along. No, it's gold now. Oh. Deal with it. Oh. You hath set it. Now you hath wrought it. It was a white button. Oh, I mean, that works too. I guess. Maybe the clasp, clasp could be the golden thread in the middle. What? Like this string that the crows oh, are like playing with is it? also the little X of the button. Yeah, that's why I have this gold in there. Yeah, see. but you asked what in such like a way that you're like, why? Yeah, why? I get it now that you're saying it in a clearer way. <laughs> but before it was confusing. No? No. Yes. Very much so. Yeah, okay. Specifically, a big, round, thick white button with four holes. Is that the line from the book? I love it. I made it the shine in this bird's eye. Jake, on your TikTok, you should read books. He's got a TikTok? Oh, yeah, yeah, remember? I told you about that video, and I was like, Jake Green's funny. <laughs> <laughs> hey, everyone, did you know? Jake's funny. <laughs> he did a video, like, talking... Mm about a bunch of different Pokemon in Pokemon Go and it's fun. Hilarious. <laughs> oh, I love it. Do your favorite impersonation of one of your favorite parts from it. He does so many voices in it. He does like 10 voices. I don't, I haven't seen it. Oh. Can, can you? I watched it multiple times. <laughs> I'm not on TikTok. I don't know how to do these things. <laughs> I'm an old lady. I can find it. Um, I think that's my favorite so far. For sure. Crows and bows and little toes. Yeah. Crows and bows and little toes? Little town. It's a quiet village. I'm never stopping singing the song. Okay. Uh, That's a good one. one. I like next it. One, next one. What is? <laughs> it kind of looks really chaotic because that one bird in the top hat is stood so standstill and the other ones are like how do i fly i'm upside down <laughs> calm it down so Goodfellow. chaotic <laughs> <laughs> the wind hath carried us away calm yourselves uh, <laughs> nerves of steel are required for this trip Blah. okay jay green went on to say and everything else was wrong and toad was very angry about all these buttons that weren't that and then Jake Green goes on to say, oh, well, no, that video is so embarrassing. And <laughs> Tara says, has it gone viral yet? And Jake Green says, don't. LOL. Don't. And Tara says, ha -ha. <laughs> Don't. <laughs> well, I want to do my first very best impersonation of Jake's impersonation. Please do. Well, there's this video of a rat -a -tat, and it's up on the screen, and he goes, a rat -a -ta. <laughs> 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 Or ha 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 ha. Mr. Ratata. <laughs> it's funny, and I love it. <laughs> I love it. Oh, I should watch this. <laughs> send me the fun TikToks, because I'm not on there, so you got to send it to me. Okay. I'll find it. <laughs> <laughs> I know, it's great, right? You're going to watch it as many times as I have, I bet. Does he get watches? Check. Like, I don't know what TikTok does if you get watches. Is it good? Is it good? Is it's it good, good for me. Happens <laughs> what happens? Is it like each like is like one little stab in the booty doll of you? I don't know. Okay, here we go. I'm sending it to you. Uh, I could just play the audio <laughs> through the mic. Do you want wait. me to do that? <laughs> Should I link. play it on here? Is that okay? Am I allowed? Jake Green, you get the final final say. You could say no if 
all these other no's have been any indication I'm going to guess no, but maybe it's a yes. I don't know. Only Jake can give the... Uh, he posted a skull. I think it's... <laughs> It's fine. He's dead. He says, you killed him. It's fine. He says it's fine. It's fine. I think he's crying, but I love it. Your okay, boy I sent it to you on Discord. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. Oh my God! What is that cursed other thing? <laughs> hey, that's the Captain Crunch video game that I love. <laughs> My nostalgic feelings. Ah! I don't want it. I don't want it. Oh, okay. Should Click on the Jake it? Green thing. Okay, Jake Green. Okay. Yeah. Okay, Jake Green. Okay. Are you Is ready the volume on? Mistake? Is the volume happening? Is yeah, the course, site muted? Right? Is it still muted? No, Did you I unmute the site? Boy, we're all okay, crashed. It's fine. Okay. Okay. Go. Breathe in through the nose. Out through the mouth. Are we okay? We're here. We talked about this during the critiques episode on our <laughs> podcast. <laughs> All right, okay, yeah, I'm good. Ready? All right, let's do this. Oh, does it? Is it? Oh, no. <laughs> False alarm. I don't know what's happening. Wait, what happens if I open it? Does it? I don't know. Go off screen sure. and then come back. I, I don't know. I don't know what it's going to show. Okay. Oh, here. Yeah. Wait, is this? Is there audio? Oh, I have it muted. Wait, unmute site. Okay, cool. <laughs> How can I do this wrong five times? Okay, let's do this. Right. Word, old word. A little rot at her. <laughs> nice. No. Vulpix. Ooh, Vulpix so fair. Shoddish, shoddish, shoddish. <laughs> Echo. I love it. I love Echo. it so much. <laughs> Did you guys diggle. know that you could love Jake Green more than you so already do? Look at his little poopy face. <laughs> what is that one? I didn't even know. Drowsy. <laughs> Picazard. No, oh, Picazard. Picazard. <laughs> Come on, get in the ball. What are you doing? <laughs> yes. Gotcha. Get the Wait, this is not a full-on iPad. Holy heck. Oh. Tangela. Tangela? <laughs> so, Emily, how many minds have you crafted? What? Twirtle, what? twirt. <laughs> a little rot at home. <laughs> okay, this is... No. Oh my gosh, it's so good, Jake. It's <laughs> a little so rot good. At home. I wish I could like it, but then I'd have to be on TikTok. <laughs> Uh, oh we're signing gosh, up for that's so honestly. good. I can't, but that's is great. Always send me the individual ones. Everybody put a green heart in the chat for Jake Green. Jake Green! Woo! That was the best. And oh, that's probably like the 20th time I've seen it. Oh, oh my gosh. I'm sweating. <laughs> it was really good. It was really good. Oh my gosh. I like that. Not at all. And. <laughs> How many minds have you crafted? <laughs> what? What? <laughs> She's so um, good. Oh my gosh. Dark Hour says best TikTok I have ever seen. <laughs> Jake Green says y'all are she too spends much. She so much time on TikTok. Right, Joe? That's what I know. Oh my gosh. Uh, thank you for that. I needed a good larf. It's really good. <sighs> Watch it again later. Uh, it course. never gets old. <laughs> Never, ever, 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 ever. Oh my gosh. So does that make you want to be on TikTok? You want to make a Pokemon um, exclusive account? Well, it just makes me happy that I know Jake Green. It doesn't <laughs> make me want to be on TikTok. But <laughs> I don't want to be on TikTok, but I'll watch all of yours. Ba -da -da -da. Dark Hour says, and I am on TikTok a lot. <laughs> and I am. <laughs> Are we getting our favorite quotes in the chat now? Anonymous says, a little ratatata. <laughs> 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 so good. Jake Green says, that's so literally fancy. the only one I made. And it's only up from here, right? <laughs> Anthony's clearly your biggest fan. So keep <laughs> creating if for no one else, just for him. Just for yeah. him. He needs it. Agreed. Agreed. Um, <laughs> agreed. 
Anthony Jackson says, good job, Shake Green. Pure or pure better on my for your page. What? What? Yes. yes. Pure Shake Green says, thank you all so much. Pure BRB. butter. <laughs> okay, I gotta go. <laughs> oh, there's something I called it for you page on TikTok. I'm remembering now. Pure better on my for you page. Yeah, that's like a algorithm thing, right? Where they're like, you like this, we'll send you more of this, that kind of thing. I think so. Sounds something. On my Instagram Explore page, it does like the same thing, where if you click on something, it's like, ooh, you like that. And it keeps giving me stuff that I hate. <laughs> Just like, oh, no. I don't want to see, like, there's like fishing things that come up where they're showing like dead whales or something. And I'm like, I don't want to see that. Dude, like, put it back. Maybe it's because you talk about Animal Crossing and fishing. So yeah, much. exactly. That's where it's crossing over. <laughs> I love cute <laughs> animals. Oh, here are animals dying. <laughs> oh, gosh. No. Oh. I need to get back Prince to says, no, we broke the Jake. <laughs> Didn't you play it the other day? I thought you logged in the other day. Oh, yeah, I can, like, log in. But I think what I want to do is, like, make progress. <laughs> My island has only gotten worse lately, where I just, like, keep on doing, like, the, the menial tasks of the day and then just dumping everything out of my pockets onto the sidewalk and then not cleaning it up. <laughs> so, like, I just need to clean up my entire island, basically. <laughs> It's what happens. Oh, hey. Well, that'd be neat if they had like a little torch and you could just go through your island and set things on fire that you didn't wow. want anymore. So you didn't have to deal with like putting it in your pocket. No, no, no. That's the thing, Anthony, it. is you never don't want something. You just want all of it to be in a place where you're probably never going to look at it. So that's what storage is. <laughs> you just keep it all at your house and you never look at it again. But maybe oh. one day when you randomly want to decorate your room, you have everything to choose from. That's true. What's the storage limit? Is it infinite? Just every item you could have in there? I have not reached the limit, so I don't know. But The limit just... does not exist. <laughs> it does exist. They just expanded it. <laughs> so it's quite large. And uh, I just got rid of some duplicates that I had. Like, I buy fashion things that I forgot I bought already. So, anywho, that's what's going on in my life. <laughs> we have about a half an hour left. By the way, I wanted to make this exactly the video that we saw the other day, where it's just a bunch of capybaras in the water with little tangerines on their head. Is that how the animal piece will evolve from its current state? It's just going to be washi tape now? Yeah, that's how it'll be. No, I could paint the same subject matter seven different ways. There's no problem with that. Not for me. I thought you were having a problem with it. Not anymore. I got over it. The capybara one? Specifically? Oh, no, I haven't, I haven't worked on that in a while. Oh. I sent you a thing on Twitter, by the way, about the next one that oh. I'm going to work on. You did? I did. I was busy watching Jake Green's compilation of the latest I Matrix clip components. It's important. You sent me a message going to the envelope six hours ago. Parents mm -hmm. waiting for their kids. Your account to follow. Farm workers? What? I don't even know what you're talking about, but sure. An important account to follow. We take farm workers so for granted. That's a message you sent me? I don't remember that, but it was the most recent one I sent you. Oh, that's just... Well, am I allowed to say it? No. <laughs> okay. well, I, but I'm curious, what are you looking at? It's about... Well, the Saturday. words that go along with the picture that you sent are an important account to follow. Oh, no. So that's I get not... that you sent me the picture with the animal and the fruit. Oh, okay, cool. There you go. But your message just had that um, part of the tweet in it and that's why I read it and you were like what is that I have no idea and I was like you sent it to me but you were sending me the picture I understand things now thank you but I also sent you a message with it did you get that oh. explaining what the meaning was <laughs> no it, he doesn't care um, no I'm going I just closed out the going, door I'm going I'm going yeah, I like that idea. I just thought it was funny. You know, sometimes the universe just hears what you're talking about and like sends stuff to you. Or thinking about. <laughs>
that was just a thought. And then it was like, oh, hello? Well, I think I was suggesting flamingos and limes. No, that's not what you suggested. So that's what I posted on my Instagram story when I was, like, shouting out the Lightbox stream this Saturday. Oh, really? I posted gotcha. an emoji of flamingos and limes. Just to let you guys know a little bit of what we're talking about, because <laughs> this is all just a conversation between Anthony and I. Uh, <laughs> when we're streaming on Saturday for the Lightbox Expo. Oh, I still forgot to remute it. You gotta remind me. Okay, Maybe, so... I can't hear it. I can't hear your desktop audio. So yeah, but whenever I show something with audio on uh, Discord, just remember to be like, is it muted? <laughs> um, okay, so what I was going to say is we were... Uh, okay, so on Saturday's stream, we're going to paint a fruity animal piece like we've been doing in fresco here and there on this, this streaming channel right here. And so uh, I was trying to decide what animal and what fruit, and then Anthony threw out a suggestion... And then, yeah, that's what we're talking about. Anyways, animals and fruits. If you ever animals think there's a really fruits. good combo that you should go, just let me know. <laughs> yeah. Or draw it yourself, or let me know and draw it yourself, because we can all draw the same things, and it would be fun. Anyways, uh, Jake said, it's not infinite storage. I'm constantly maxed out. Uh, Dang, so what is it? Is it like a 999 situation? I have no idea. But Jake hmm. would probably know better if he's constantly maxed out. It's Why lot, are you though. hoarding all those goods when you could be selling them? In, indeed. They actually send you stuff like that. If your island is full of, like, there's things on the ground like mine is, then they're like, you know you can sell those things and make money. <laughs> you idiot. <laughs> <laughs> idiot. But, uh, yeah, it's all in, in, like, the off chance that you might use it someday. That kind of thing. Yeah. Oh, Chick Green says it's like... 2400 now did you say 2400 or do you say 2400 me jake oh you're asking him how he expresses that number <laughs> yeah i don't want to say it like that it sounds so like <laughs> clinical <laughs> well, jake green says i said 2400 zero, zero. <laughs> wait <Wink. laughs> <laughs> you clever boy. Oh, man. Uh, how do you say it, Anthony? 2400, I think I did. Yeah, I think when it's written out, it would be like that. But if there's a comma, instantly memory Ooh. is like 2400. Ooh, the comma. Ooh, the comma. <laughs> Coming in hot. Jake Green says 2400. Aha. So now we all know exactly how Jake thinks. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. I'm trying to find a good value for these oranges so that they're not completely blending in with the green. Maybe I just need to make the green a little bit darker. Possibly? Maybe? Windows key? Get out of my life! Get out of Get here. Get out of my way. Shake Green says, if there were numbers after the four, I would say the thousand. Two thousand four hundred and thirty-four. Numbers after the four. Okay, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, that makes sense. Do you say, okay, how do you say the word D-A-T-A? Data. <laughs> Sounds so natural coming from you. Wow. <coughs> Data. <laughs> da 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 da. Yeah, video game music. Ah, boy. Ooh. Ooh. James Baxter. Okay, uh, blue one. Should we do blue bananas, blue durian, blue porcupine, blue axolotl? Axolotl makes sense. Um, do you want to do something that makes sense? It's supposed to be all together, ooky. Noodles and axolotls? Oh. I was thinking color combo. Mm okay. Blue durians. okay. <clears throat> yeah, yeah, I'm fine with that. Um, um. Data, Jake Green says. Data. 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 Data.
Theta. And then goes on to say Axo Noodles. <laughs> Up top, Axo Noodles. <laughs> oh man. Okay. Um. Let's see. I'm just gonna sketch some stuff, I guess. I'm not very clear in my brain what I want to do next. I kind of want to just like revamp the the pancakes, but I don't know if that's okay to do. Ooh ah, ta da da be da, da 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 da, be da be da, yellow axolotls. You know what I love? Salamanders. What's that? Salamanders? Yeah, they're like snacks, but with tiny little legs. They're so cute. Anonymous posted a reference to Hamilton about commas. Alexander Hamilton. Oh, yeah. Comma. Uh, what was it? Something assigned. Your obedient servant. A. Dot Burr. Oh, yeah. This one's in a letter I received from you two weeks ago. I noticed a comma in the middle of a phrase, and it changed the meaning. Did you intend this? Did you intend this? One stroke and One you've, stroke consumed, and you've my consumed my waking, waking days. days, it says. Ugh. The yeah. song Burn is so good. Especially from the demo tape, I think. Or it was... After Hamilton came out, he was doing like a monthly Hamilton drop thing, and it was songs from Hamilton, but sang from different cast members, depending on the location that they performed, or by like famous musicians. And I think for Burn, they got the leads that played Eliza, was it? Eliza! Yeah in every like major city and they all performed the song together and it was beautiful Very but beautiful. it was also different lyrically than what was in the actual like cut of the production mm -hmm. this was like a, a prototype for the song or something. yeah it's definitely though. it is really i think i prefer it more than the actual song in the production scandal no, you're allowed to like things <laughs> more than what um but yeah you still haven't watched the disney plus hamilton have you not yet you gotta do it make it a night make some popcorn it's very good anonymous says in every conversation i gotta reference hamilton gotta uh, I just saw a commercial for the movie version of Dear Evan Hansen, which is another very popular musical. So, there you go. A little information. Have you ever heard of that one? Yeah, I think I have. Mm -hmm. I have not seen or heard anything from it, so that would be really fun to go into it with, like, no knowledge at all. Of mm -hmm. course, I would prefer to do that with, like, a actual Broadway show or whatever you call it, but uh, I don't think I'm going to go to one of those in a very long time, so might as well see the movie. Yeah. Ibrahim says, I've been doing some work since four in the morning and I kind of need a break. Gotta go do Chill. some workout. Thanks for the stream as always. Bye. Have a great night and thank you so much for joining us and also just enjoy the the workout uh kendall was also saying that like i'm gonna exercise <laughs> during the stream which is awesome that is the best reason to not be at the computer get your body moving do the things <laughs> this guy looks a little odd but you know whatever axolotl eh eh what if we just make them really long yeah, exolongles. <laughs> Anonymous says in The Little Mermaid, what's a fire and what's the word? And then Phil Philippa So singing the burn part. Philippa So played Eliza and Hamilton. Nice. <laughs> that would be a funny way to like, I don't know, make those melodies fit, fit together where it's like little mermaid and then suddenly they're talking about burning their husband's letter to her lo his lover <laughs> like oh man or wait those letters were to her so i mean she's his lover but whatever you know oh, what whatever. i mean if you haven't seen hamilton that's the same thing hamilton get the said. Context. <laughs> but whatever 
She's not my wife, but I guess whatever. Jeez. So dark. Um, and Omni says, I may have to go too. And Rin says, these washi designs are so joyful thus far. Best wishes, Ibrahim and Anonymous. Absolutely. And Jake Green says, yes, they are the noodles. They are the noodles, exactly. Just make them long. You get it. Just what? Just make them long. Just make them long. But I mean, like, longer. More long. Yeah, I'd like washi tape with long axolotls on them. That's always the question I try to ask whenever, like, uh, doing any product design stuff is, like, would I want to own this? And I think long ax axolongles would definitely be up there for me. And I'd put them all over Anthony's flowers. They're just cute little dragons. You know? Yeah! If they were longer, it'd just be like, oh, that's an actual sea dragon. Do you want it to be longer? I'll make it a sea dragon. It kind of already looks like sea dragon, but yeah. Oh, yeah. Get it. Okay, it's so like a luck dragon. Yeah. Oh my gosh, that was a very abrupt turn of its bod. Oh, could we do... <gasps> Wait, I have an idea. Yes, this is what's happening. A loop-de-loop. -loop. A loop-de-loop. That's springy. That's how they swim. They just like coil up and then spring forward. Oh my gosh, how cool would that be? Oh, you can see a creature that does like crazy actions like that. I love deep ocean creatures. I never want to see them in like real life or be that deep in the ocean, but just the idea of them is fascinating. Like wow. aliens on our planet, you know? It's great. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Loop de loop? With all that loop de loop. Movie. The drawing pirate says, or a chicken. Oh, lol, don't mind me. Or a chicken? What? I don't know. Springy? Spring chicken? I don't know. I ain't no spring chicken. <laughs> <laughs> I have a I have a picture in my mind of a piece now, not like a not not a washi tape piece, but like a, a you vertical a piece. Capybara eating a uh, tangerine as well, since the other ones are interacting with them. Okay. What is oh, this wait, little guy? Just to indulge me for a second. Ooh. <laughs> I don't know what's happening there. Ooh. Just like a ribbon of axolotl. Yeah, basically. And then it comes back down and he's like standing on the other side. <laughs> it's just like his body goes up and has fun. <laughs> it's like a, a territorial cat or something. <laughs> He goes, hiss, hiss. Oh, hiss, hiss. <laughs> yeah, but imagine this is like a vertical like piece. I think that's Yeah, fun. yeah, yeah. Anyways. That is fun. You know, Kindle in the chat. Um, and the drawing pirates clarifies, oh, no! it looks like a chicken, the one in the middle. This one? Is that a chicken? chicken. Oh, yeah, it kind of looks chickeny. Oh, with the... Okay, now I can yeah. see it. Like, it's going... <laughs> I need to wow. my eyebrow and no. Do you see? Do you see? Yeah. <laughs> I like that its top beat goes way past its eye. <laughs> That's how you do it in expression land. You just push it. <laughs> yeah. I love it. Oh, it's funny. <laughs> see, you guys see things that I would never, and I appreciate that very, very much. Also, now I want to do a funky chicken one. Should we do that down here? Just be like... Uh, let's try to capture that emotion. <laughs> this is the chicken. Do you see? <laughs> kind of looks like an axolotl, huh? <laughs> Give me a break. <laughs> I can only draw one or the other. Rin says, oh my goodness, I'm loving this axolotl noodle dragon. Yes, noodle dragons. Also, I'm just going to make this the cuckoo one where they're all angry as heck. And they're just like enraged. Kindle says, angry chicken. Here. Yeah. Legend of Zelda. Be nice yes. to the chickens. Exactly. <laughs> this is normal drawing. I'm an artist. The part. pancake one feels so different than all the other ones. Yeah, of course, because it was like one of the first times. <laughs> That's what happens. 
That's why you warm up, you know? I like the idea of the pancakes, but definitely not the execution. <laughs> we have about 10 minutes left. Angry. Angry. Rah. Rah. This one's got a lot of angry energy. Angry. Exactly. Angry chickens. <laughs> on the blue, OMG, crying. <laughs> it belongs on the blue, come on. Uh, and for cuckoos, they're always like a white-ish, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah? Is that true? I feel like there are probably Very different iterations kids. of them, eh? I imagine. They're very angry, and I think I'd probably put some, like, weird emotional colors and lines coming off of them, where it's like, anger, anger, you know? Yeah, um, yeah. <laughs> These could also be really nice as hens, because the nice orange of the hen, the red's fine. The white's fine. Or whatever. I mean, do cuckoos look different than hens? <sighs> yeah, hens are, like, brown and red. Tell me what to make them. I have no idea. I'm trying to Google it. I'll also have to look. Yeah, they just look like oh, chickens. Sorry. They just look like And chickens. they've got a red bit under their beak as well. Like two little yeah, things. Okay. I think Let's... that's all you're really missing. There you go. Boom. Boom. Do you Chicken. feel their rage? Oh, yeah. I feel like the expressive nature of the brushwork and the quickness of the lines just makes a makes a very evocative image. Uh, I feel. I feel their pain. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I feel their anger. And then there was that weird chicken thing from Twilight Princess. <laughs> weird chicken thing? Wouldn't that be a cuckoo also? I don't mm. remember what you're talking about. Oh, well, I'll send you a picture. You won't like it. <laughs> I love it when you preface things like that. <laughs> Let me send you something. You won't like it. It's bad. Why do you send me things I don't like when I give you uh, Bane Cat? You give well, because we were talking about chickens from Legend of Zelda, so it's relevant. Topical. Topical horrifying <laughs> uh alessandra says oh she just posted the cr uh, crayon study on the discord let's check it out do 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 oh okay let's see okay Ooh. first of all anonymous panda says oh, i'm sort of leaning to pearl crayons looks interesting i am very interested in what that looks like yeah so, thank you for uh, labeling all of these diligently, Alessandra. This is amazing. Big Dippo Ruby. I like that one. Big Dippo Ruby. <laughs> all right, so metallic. That's going to be hard to see in, like, not very specific lighting, I'm sure. Um, cosmic crayons. I'm really digging this palette. That's cool. Also, Pacific Blue. Wild Strawberry. Mm -mm -mm. I love it. Juicy. Yes. Uh, pearl crayons. Interesting. Ooh, Shooting Star. Apple Orchard, Caribbean Sea, Hot Cocoa. Something that you're getting with all of these, despite, like, even taking out the idea of them having different finishes, like metallic or whatever, um, just the range of colors you're getting in each box is nice. I feel like they're all slightly different. And then we've got the neon crayons. Oh my gosh. Check it Laser out. Laser lemon. Boom. I really like outrageous orange. I feel like that's, I know, you yeah. know. Outrageous. Outrageous audio. <laughs> Shocking pink. Oh, what happened? That pink. My eyes. So we've got neon, uh, metallic, cosmic, pearl so far. Neon. Okay, so we don't have pastel yet. And unicrayons. I'm guessing unicrayons is just like a, a regular old a rainbow. But, um... Yeah, that is awesome. What are you going to do with them? I like how you began with like squares around it and stuff. And then you're just like, nah, here's a color. <laughs> I feel that in my bones. <laughs> Thank you so much for doing that, Alessandra. It helps us all understand what's going on. 
I love it. Also, I hope you have fun drawing with them. I think that that would be a really fun little, uh, like, crayon time. I'm gonna make a safe space around my crayons and just draw with them. Oh, it's 555. <gasps> Repeating numbers, make a wish. Five minutes to go. Make a wish, make a wish. I did it. You're welcome. Uh, well... Did you do it? Sound of yeah. Okay, good. <laughs> By the way, uh, before the stream... Equivalent exchange. Brother yeah. Edward. Brother Edward. Uh, before the stream, I was making pizza dough, and I made a double batch, baby. It's gonna be four oh. pizzas worth. <laughs> Tara says, see you on Saturday, Anna. See you on Saturday! Have a great Bye. one, Tara. Uh, and also, uh, see you on Friday. We're gonna po post the podcast then, and you know, you know, it'll be a special one, Tara. <laughs> Bryn has a pun. In <gasps> Japanese, we all wish we wouldn't have to go. Five. Ah, hey. High five. Five is go. Amazing, Rin. Amazing. Yeah. Pretty good. <laughs> uh, oh my gosh. Uh, what's the thank you in Japanese? Arigato. 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 Oh yeah, uh, Dark Hours slash Joe slash the best person is going to be streaming in a little over an hour. Very Part two. exciting. Part two of the APAC streams. I It's a criminal offense that they're so short, but they are amazing. And I want to see more of Joe's amazing bookmark. It's so cute. It's a bookworm. You got to see book it for worm. yourself. Yeah. Everybody in the chat, we were talking about it when uh, Joe was designing it. And we were all like, uh, they were giving us a difference between like um do you do the full word uh, word of bookworm with the worm or just book and then the worm is the worm and then everybody in the chat was like i think it works best with the full word and then joe started putting in just the book part of it and we were all like i changed my mind your design is flawless just do whatever you want because you're clearly like the best at what you do it was great it's good it's good it's so good uh it was amazing just to see that what time are you life. streaming saturday me you mean us uh, we yeah no the question is what time are you streaming saturday on lightbox anna it is 1 p.m pacific time so i don't know where you are alessandra but i would convert it to your time if i could i think the east coast and three hours ahead three of hours. us okay so that would be 10 a.m.? Yeah? Sounds... Math? Well, they're three hours ahead, so if we're doing it at one, it would be... Nine? Ten. Two, three, four o'clock on the East Coast, because they're ahead of us. Wait, is that how that works? Yeah, because it becomes night there first, because the sun sets on our side, so it would be four o'clock if we're there if we're doing it at one o'clock here. I believe you're Same. correct. Yeah, that's the thing. Ryan always is like, I'm going to go eat dinner after a stream, which is totally what I do. But he does it when we're starting, which means that he's later. So, yes. Good job, Anthony, with your <laughs> brain, your massive, gigantic brain. It's oozing out of your oh, ears. Oh, so it weird. hurts so much. <laughs> oh, oh. <no. laughs> uh, sorry for my tiny little peanut one. It's chucking along real hard. Okay, it's No, it did place. it. It did that. It, it knew three no, hours difference. No. It just Not did true. it the wrong way. <laughs> we were correct. Um, Tara says, excited to hear it. Bye, everyone. Got to pick something up. See you at Joe's stream. Then Saturday, Lightbox party. Fantastic. Woo and don't forget about Friday. Friday, the podcast comes out at four. So. Indeed. If you want more of this, by the way, this sign up for a little of that by our podcast, which is called Oops All Bloops. It's where we talk about life, our inspiration. Our uh, episode this week is about critiques. So if you want to be a part of that, you can subscribe right above the chat. There is a link and also on just my Behance page. Uh, and it's $3 a month for two podcasts that are one hour each. 
probably over that. And also access to our private Discord channel where we talk about things all about the episodes and things like that. So uh, if you want to support us or if you want podcast access, then please join in. Um, by the way, they come in the form of Behance projects and they are videos. So you get to watch us and listen to us. There you go. Boom. Perfect way to wrap up the stream right here at six o'clock. Oh, is it? Okay. It is. We've arrived. I didn't get to all the colors, but just cut off the end of the rainbow and look, we did it. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. So we got stacks on stacks on stacks with our ladybug friends. We've got our cute fall crows with a button button and the zhuzhes and also our axolongles. Axolongle. <laughs> our noodle boys, our capybara tangerine friends. Our stacks on stacks on stacks of Hannah Cooks, and we're gonna re render that to make it more stylized. And then angry, angry, angry cuckoos slash hens. <laughs> wow, cuckoos. Cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs. Chicken. Uh, it's just a funny chicken. It's just a funny chicken. Don't hurt it. Or else. So, uh, From thank you. So over much the garden wall. What? Over the garden wall. Over the garden wall when the peacock comes up and he's like, oh, it's yeah. just a funny chicken. <laughs> I don't remember that at all, but sure. It's so funny. Oh, I remember this creature that you sent me on uh, Discord. <laughs> the, what are they called? Ako, Ako. Yeah, songs? like Oko, 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 something like that. Oko. I actually liked them. I felt like there was something calming about them when I was playing the game. Is that weird? <laughs> <laughs> I love it. The chat's just like curse, curse chicken. <laughs> from Moana. This is from Twilight Princess, Legend of Zelda. This was not in Moana. Are they calling that hey hey? <laughs> hey 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 was way more endearing than this creature. Oh my gosh, Joe is just like Anna. <laughs> if something was comforting about it. Maybe I'm from hell. It just was like a memory. Like, oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You again. <laughs> One of my uh, hellish memories. I'm Hellboy. <laughs> Rising to the surface. Oh, hey, hey. <laughs> oh, anyways. Okay. So thank you so much for tuning in. We will definitely revisit these washi tapes to work on them further. And maybe you'll see an axolotl piece thrown in there because I want to paint that now. Uh... <laughs> Oh no, Jake's cat. Got Jake stuck has a cat emergency. <laughs> Go save the kitty. El Go gato. save the cat. Take care. Take care. Oh my gosh. Um, Rin is asking what happens when you try to harm the Breath of the Wild chickens. It's not a good time for you. If is you that what happens in Breath of the Wild? Uh, yeah. Cuckoos. Wait. I don't know if I've attacked cuckoos in the game. I. You can use them to like drift. If you're holding them, that kind of thing. Um, but I, I try to not harm anyone or anything in real life or otherwise. So, have not tried it. <laughs> uh, anyways, thank you so much. <laughs> you guys are too funny in the chat. I can't say goodbye. And Anonymous Panda says my dog is trying, constantly trying to choke himself with his collar. I hate it so much when dogs do that. <laughs> Like, they're just struggling. That's one of the reasons I really want to train my dog to heal, just so they don't resist against the collar, because it hurts me when they get hurt. <laughs> I hate it. They're so dumb sometimes. You know, they can be, but I love them. They're like, I cannot breathe, but I'm so happy about life. <laughs> like, stop! The only time that oh that happened with my mom's dog, um, a dog came up from behind a fence that we were walking next to and was very aggressive and like, rah, 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 rah. and our little dachshund just immediately yeeted himself in the opposite direction. And I was holding oh, the leash and he was I'm just too like, small no. for this. I was like, no, to baby. Yeah, um, that's why harnesses are much better because it offers more distributed support. Absolutely, we use a harness now on him, but he's an old doggo. He couldn't take that again. So yeah, definitely harness. Um, anyways, we are going to say goodbye. Thank you so much for hanging out with us. It was a blast today. And uh, I just, I feel like 
We're gonna get through this week. It's gonna be a good one. Today's only Wednesday. We almost are. Only. I We're know. already halfway through. Oh, I know. It's gone really fast. And just a reminder what we have going on r- later in the week. We have the podcast on Friday, and we've got Saturday, Lightbox stream, 1 p.m. Pacific. We're going to be here on Behance, and also you can find us on the Lightbox schedule. Uh, remember to get vaccinated, wear a mask, wash your hands, be a good human being, uh, be kind to others and yourself. Anthony, is there anything you'd like to say before we head on out? No, I think that pretty much wraps it up. Support Anna on Patreon if you can, and share this video and like it and stuff. Support Anna Anthony won't ever say those things. Talks with goofy voices. Oh well, yeah, Jake Green specifically. <laughs> and with More that, of that, we will see you later. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Bye. <laughs>